All right, good afternoon. We've got a special guest in the building today. It's Luna Cat. Say hello to the guests. Hello. <laughs> yeah, oh, she's extra passionate today. So she's going to be joining us for the duration of the video. Sorry, I'm pretty stoned because I needed to relax myself because I've just had a terrible experience. Um, she actually released some anger energy in me. I've just been to the corner shop and I had £1.50 in a coin, £1 coin and a 50 pence coin. And then I had a shed load of two peas. Uh, well, not a shed load, a pound's worth of two, pain, two pence coins. Okay. And then I took those to the shop just by myself, a carton of coconut water. And the shopkeeper, all masked up, was extremely rude. He went, this is extremely dangerous, handing me these coins, which proves they're trying to get coins out. They're trying to get rid of them now. Um, which means we may well be looking at either the global reset or switching over from the um, fiat system the old system into the quantum financial system let's see if it unfolds i don't know that well, looks pretty mad but the guy in the shop man he was so rude uh, he said it's extremely dangerous i said bullshit that's your opinion i said if you don't want my money don't take it i'll go and get buy my coconut water elsewhere bro i'm giving you custom oh man it angered me so much so i had to come back roll a joint and chill out with my cat for a little bit you know, bonding with bonding with animals for me is meditative. And, you know, look how well bonded we are. This is all we do, you know. It's the same with my dog. Huh. So we have like a telepathic connection kind of thing. Obviously, language doesn't work with animals. <laughs> um. So this is a follow-up video to the one I did yesterday. Don't want to go on too much about the guy in the shop because he really did make me angry. I had to, to leave the shop. He made me, he made me wait while he counted all the two peas, by the way, to check I wasn't ripping him off. I go in, I've been going in this shop since I was a child, and he and then I he, I he counted them. It was the exact amount, so I just slammed the door and walked out. I'm usually extremely polite with my peas and cues, but not anymore because I thought enough's enough. Really pissed me off. So I'm going to talk a bit more about the holistic um, health products that I bought online after seeing them in various videos and various people using them to boost their immune system. So I jumped on the same train and see what you think of them. First up, we got the black seed oil. We got the black seed oil, Luna. Right, which is this stuff. I use this brand. It's called Epic Nature. Can you if you can focus on that. 100% black seed oil, strong, 100 milliliters, which is the 3.5 fluid ounce bottle. I'm going to tell you some of its benefits. It supports a healthy liver function. It supports your joint health. Joint. <laughs> um, it aids your digestive system health, which is good for me. Promotes healthy heart function. Um, supports healthy lung function. And we all know how important those lungs are. For that breath. It nourishes healthy skin and hair, which is why you see me looking so radiant, other than this spot. <laughs> um, it supports immune system health, and it supports your weight management plans, so it could really help out with your diet, should you be on one. So that's the first product. Like I say, the extra strong stuff, organic, 100%. Uh, black seed oil and the brand is epic nature uh, epic nature online the second one i bought is this here we can see it gaia moss 100 percent organic sea moss okay and you see where it says wild i don't know if you can focus on that wild crafted sea moss gel and wild crafted means that it comes from the ocean um, because you get some stuff online that is fake. Uh, you'll say it's sea moss gels come from a pond somewhere. It's not come from the ocean. This stuff actually comes from the ocean because I researched it, and the ingredients are just wild crafted sea moss and spring water. Um, and I'm going to tell you how you can consume it and some of its benefits. Um, so Gaia Moss is the brand that I use. Um, sea moss consists of different vitamins which are very essential to our human body. It has vitamins such as A, B, C, D, E and K. 
Um, each vitamin has its own importance, which I'm about to go through with you right now. I'm going to list them off. So vitamin A helps improving your eyesight. It also helps in developing immunity against cold and flu, which is clearly good with the um, C19 virus. I'm not going to say it in case I flipping get taken down. <laughs> vitamin, well, we all know how much taking down is going on censorship at YouTube right now. Vitamin B, which reduces fatigue. Um, it helps in regulating the metabolism of the body. It maintains the nervous system and your skin health, which is extremely important. Um, vitamin C, which I consume a shed load of, which is why I drink a hell of a lot of coconut water as well, which tastes so sweet which is why it's good because I like I've got a sweet tooth um, and if you change your diet then you're not going to find a lot of sweet foods really um, so I like the coconut water uh, vitamin C helps in maintaining the immune system of the body it also aids in absorbing iron in the body now I take multivitamins and iron as supplements separately as well um, vitamin D I also take vitamin D and calcium as a supplement separate uh, it maintains your bone health and it improves the deficiency of calcium in the body. And vitamin E acts as antioxidants, which protects against your cell walls. I didn't know that. Vitamin K it helps rec the body recover from the clotting of blood. Nice. Vitamin B12, which I take as a supplement as well, helps the body's nerve and blood cells. Um, a cat's gone now. There she goes. And bye. <laughs> okay, vitamin B12 it helps the body's nerve and blood cells. Um, it keeps it makes them healthy, and it helps make the DNA, the genetic material in all your cells. And vitamin B1 or thiamine helps prevent complications in the nervous system, your brain, your muscles, your heart, your stomach, and your intestines. All right, so I'm going to tell you a bit more about this wildcrafted sea moss gel. It contains 92 out of the body's 102 minerals, so obviously good to consume in that. I refrigerated it as soon as it arrived just to make it fresh, you know, a bit colder. I, I eat it raw, you see, I just munch the stuff, it's like jelly. Um, so I orally digest it, like I say, but you can apply it to your skin or your hair. You could use it like a face mask. Or a hair mask, it's totally up to you. It can be used as a vegan gelatine replacement. It can be used to thicken soups, stews and curries. Um, so, well, like I say, I eat it completely raw. It's totally up to you. Um, if you want to get the same one I did, you can look up uh, Gaia Seamoss on Instagram. Um, or at Gaia Seamoss underscore. Um, and then you receive 10% off as well, which is pretty decent you know if any of these guys want to sponsor me by the way for bigging up the products i wouldn't mind now at the start of the year when the c19 virus first hit i did take hill and what i decided to do was self-quarantine anyway just in case without getting tested because the test is bullshit remember the tasmanian president who tested the pawpaw fruit and the goat yeah and that came back positive and I've just watched a video recently. It's on my profile. If you've got me on Facebook, um, scroll down and you'll see it. There's a young lad who did two sets of tests. One on his cat, one on his dog, and one on the pavement outside. Seriously. Um, he sent them off. To, oh, it wasn't his dog. One on the cat, one on his computer keyboard, and one on the pavement outside. And he sent them off, all three of them, um, two times and under different sets of names. The tests come back and they were positive on one set and they were negative on the other. Come on, man, the government's lying to us. It's so obvious by now, and if you're not had enough and you're not standing up, then it's not good enough, man. You, you obviously don't really care for humanity and life, and that sucks because life's so important, man. It's a gift. It was a given to you. Like, you should be so grateful right now and expressing gratitude, and if you don't know how to express gratitude, then you suck. And I don't like to believe that any of us suck because we're all connected and that means I am you and you are me so we are one, so love you. <laughs> um, the next product, like I say, I had a bit of a cold slash thing. I don't know what it was. I did, I did have a temperature as well, so I stayed in my room for the 14 days just watching programs on my computer and stuff. Uh, a few entertainment series and stuff like that. 
Um, and I bought this stuff for stumbled across this Allen's pine and honey syrup, now natural honey and lemon syrup. Uh, it's really good, a traditional herbal medicinal product used for the relief of symptoms of mucus, coughs and colds based on traditional use only. Now someone was in front of the, in the queue at the shop and they said, have you got any of that medicine left, that good stuff for me? And the shopkeeper said, yeah, and pulled out this stuff. And I was intrigued. I was like, what good medicine? Maybe I need to get a bottle of this just in case anyone does get ill. And then I got a bottle of it. I was interested in what she bought. And she bought it. And I said, um, oh, maybe I'll get that in case anyone does get ill. And then I got ill a couple of days later, funnily enough. So I did lock myself in my room, consumed this pine and honey syrup, if it focuses. Yeah. And I swear down, man, I was fine. A couple of days, a couple of days later, I was all right, man. I had a temperature as well. Like I say, my bed sheets wet in the morning when I was waking up, and it wasn't because of good dreams. It was, <laughs> it was because I was sweating my back out during the night, and it wasn't very comfortable. So, um, I don't recommend that. I don't think I had the virus. I just think I had a really bad seasonal, you know, chest infection and flu type thing. Uh, I don't know what it was, but it sucked. It's gone now anyway, you know, so just goes to show you don't, you don't need to panic and buy into the fear and rush off to the hospital and go and get tested straight away when you know that's bullcrap anyway. You don't need to buy into that energy. You just need to chill out, stay in. Or something else I did was fill a bowl full of... Oh, the cat's back. Hello. Full, fill a bowl full of <clears throat> steaming hot water. I placed a towel around the back of my head and I was consuming the steam and without letting it escape into the rest of the room. Hello, chicken. Here she is. Oh, lunatic. Mm, give us a kiss. Give us a kiss. Kiss the camera. <laughs> okay. So, um, I haven't got much more to say to you today, really. I'm much more calmer now. I've spoke to you guys. Um, thanks for watching my video. Hit like. Subscribe. Tell your friends to do the same. Love animals. Love yourself. Practice everything that I've mentioned in the list in the first video. Raise your vibration. Be prepared for the shift in the earth. It's all coming. We're awakening. It's happening. Love you all.